But one of the big things to recognize is that, going along with the self-leader here, is that to a self-leader, events and situations and people are like tofu. So my wife's a vegan. Any vegans in here? Sorry. Um, I, no, I'm just kidding. I don't, I don't, I don't get it, but, it, but it's, it's great. It's, she cheats sometimes, uh, not on me. I mean, like she eats cheese and stuff sometimes. She's a little bit of a cheater, but typically she's, she eats pretty vegan. So there's no, there's no meat in our house. We, there's no meat. We cook no meat in our house. So I have to go out and get bacon whenever I can and then spray Febreze all in the car to make sure she doesn't smell it. And so she said, hey, honey, do you want to try tofu? And I'm like, oh, God, no, tofu. That's, who thinks tofu is disgusting? Anybody? Yeah, right? Okay. You're full of crap. You're absolutely full of crap, and so was I, because tofu has no flavor. Tofu is entirely neutral until you flavor it. You want teriyaki grilled tofu? You throw a bunch of teriyaki sauce and you grill it. You want fried barbecue tofu? You throw a bunch of barbecue sauce on it and you fry it. It's neutral until we flavor it. And this is something the self-leader gets. When an event happens, when somebody says something, when something happens that maybe is not ideal, instead of jumping directly to this is good, this is bad, they recognize this is neutral until I flavor it, until I give it some kind of meaning and then create a feeling from that meaning. So the big difference here when anything happens in a prisoner's life versus a self-leader's life is the type of interpretation that they have of an event. And it's very, very simple and it's a question that I ask myself all the time anytime something happens. What would be a productive interpretation of this event? Right, again, it's not right or wrong. There are unproductive interpretations, things that don't serve you, and there are productive interpretations, things that do serve you. Again, not about lying, not about Pollyanna thinking, not about rainbow colored glasses, but it's about saying, if there was a possibility that there is a more productive interpretation of this than what I'm seeing as it, you know, reacting to, to see it as a different way, what could that be? What could the productive interpretation be?